As we wake up this morning, the moon will have moved into Leo and we're starting to prepare for the new moon that will happen tomorrow morning. My name is Sarah, I'm SRB Stars and all the things. If you'd like to learn how to work with me, get my digital download courses and so on, pause to read. So we are at the very end of the balsamic phase until 6.13 a.m. Central Time tomorrow. That's when the new moon is at 12 degrees of Leo. So I invite you to check in your chart to see what house 12 degrees of Leo falls for you. And if there's any personal planets, Sun, Moon, Mercury, Mars, or Venus, that might be talking to this moon, plus or minus three degrees. So nine degrees of Leo through 15 degrees of Leo, Aquarius, Scorpio or Taurus. Mine is going to be directly across from my moon, so I know it might be a little bit emotional. This Leo moon is not without drama because not only do we get to have a Leo new moon tomorrow, Venus is going to move into Virgo and Mercury is going to start retrograde. And I'll talk about that tomorrow. Today is about the Leo new moon. With this new moon, it is our last one before eclipse season. So use it to charge your crystals, make your moon water, all the things. To me, this new moon is about your determination to tap into things that make you, you. Because the Leo sign is all about our ego. And there's some beautiful aspects between Jupiter and Mars that might give you creativity and the desire to move in and dig in deep, while Saturn is also squaring Jupiter. So it might help you trim down those goals to bite-sized pieces because Leo likes to go all in and be dramatic and do all the things. But still, you got to be realistic at times. And when Venus moves into Virgo, that realistic aspect can really punctuate as well. This is a really great time to think about what are those next steps for you to move forward in those goals? How can you have the most authentic self? How can you balance that authenticity with what you want to be in the community and at large with how you want to present yourself? There's so much beautiful energy with this new moon with, between Venus changing sign and Mercury going retrograde later in that day. You do have a really a lot of time to really reflect and hone in on those goals that you want to accomplish over the next 30 days. Are you excited? Let me know.